the winner of the 2014 West Australian Medium Business Award is Monford Group, Proprietary Limited. I'm far from Superman, trust me. Um, as, thanks very much for the award. Um, it's great to be here. Um, sorry, you know, I must apologise. Public speaking is not my best trait. I wish I had Brad's skill in that department, but unfortunately I don't. Um, so it's just great to be here and, and appreciate the award. Just like to thank Brad for his speech earlier on. It was very inspirational just listening to you talk and listening to your story. Um, when I was listening to you talk, I, I heard a lot of common traits in what you were saying and what I'd done as well in my story as we were going. Um, I had a business as well as you, at a young age, determined to, your passion was motorbikes, my passion was construction. My first job in construction when I was 11. And same thing, determined to get that job. I queued up outside the building site every day for a year until the builder got sick of me and said, right, come on. I know there's child labor laws probably involved, but <laughs> get in there and start working. So I did and um, just loved it and, and been in construction ever since. And in the evenings, um, I used to take the pallets home from the building site and chop up the timber and make kindling and sell the firewood to the shops. So that was my first business adventure at 11 years of age. Then I realized the shops were making, I was selling it to 70p a bag, they were making a pound. So I was thinking, nah, I'm gonna sell door to door, direct sales, <laughs> cut them out of picture. So that was my, my first business adventure, adventure anyway. And, I kind of haven't stopped since, and since construction is my passion, I kind of put my passion and entrepreneurial flair together, and that's where I've ended up today with Monfort Group. But um, Monfort Group, like most people have been saying today, it's the people that have built it, and um, it's the people that built our company too. Some people here, like PSS, probably worked with our guys on the Wheatstone Project and would know a few of them, and I'm sure they can say they're hardworking people. They all are within the business, and it wouldn't have been where it is today without my partner, Carly, here, who's also the CFO. Um, which is good and bad at times, <laughs> <laughs> helps. So she's, we've done everything together since we started the business, including making babies and more babies. <laughs> so, um, I, might, I might hand this over to Carly, you might be able to understand her accent a little bit better, but um, thanks very much for the award, appreciate it. Thank you. I guess we just say thank you to the Telstra Business Awards and the judges um, and to the competitors because there's some really great businesses out there. We were here last year like Arm for Life and it is a really tough process to get through and it's really good for your business and I guess we're just happy to accept the award and, and on the behalf of me and Declan, we, we'd like to thank our team. We, you know, there's 180 of them but they're, each of them are unique and they're, they really are the, you know, why we're here. They, they're so hardworking and they're, they're a great team. So thank you everyone. <laughs>